Hello ladies and gents, welcome back to a new watch video. Today we're taking a look at the Casio Databank Calculator watch. Um, it's a new watch to me, I paid $29.99 for it at Argos. Uh, link in the description below will lead you to that should you wish to purchase it. For reference, it is model DBC-611E-1EF. DBC, I assume, is Data Bank Calculator. Um, as I said, uh, it's another Casio. It comes on a bracelet, which uh, is fully adjustable. Um, and yeah, we'll have a look at some of the features. So let's get into this bad boy. See here, standard Casio box, the cardboard box. Don't really keep these boxes because got plenty of them and uh, there's not too much to them. So inside the box, you see here the timepiece itself. Now I have had this out, guys, I will stress. I've already had it on, uh, set to my size, etc. So we'll put the timepiece just to the side for now and have a look inside the rest of the box. We've got the usual sort of array of, of stuff. So the tag there again with the uh, the model number there. It's an EU, of course, I'm in Britain, if you can't tell by my voice. And then we have, here we go, as, as usual, as expected, Casio's gigantic million page manual with the guarantee card and all the other sort of warranty card and paperwork. You know, this watch got quite a lot of functions which I'll, I'll sort of go through, but um, all sorts of languages in there, all good stuff. So let's get on to the timepiece itself. Grab it out of this bag. I say, comes on a bracelet. Like, uh, like some of these Casios do, really nice, here we are. So here's the timepiece itself, and I apologize about the reflection. As you can see, you've got the digital display just there, and then the, uh, the calculator part here. It is a touchpad calculator, it's not buttons. However, it works surprisingly well, even for my big fat fingers. Um, I seem to be able to sort of do it quite well. So you can see there the bracelets, this sort of, slotted style with the standard Casio adjustable clasp. You don't have to take any links or anything out here, you just stick a pen in there, any sort of tool, flip that up and then you can move this this piece up and down which allows you to adjust for the wrist. Um, so it just hooks on with a with the standard clasp there. The back has, as you can see the case, it's quite, it is shaped so it does sit uh, okay on the wrist. If I just, I'll show you there, it sits quite flat to the wrist. Um, it's, it's not uncomfortable to wear for such a, a long, a longer piece. You can see there on the back we've got some information. So I don't know if that, that will focus or not, maybe not. But it says, yeah, Telemomo 25, five multifunctional arms, calculator, dual time. So we we'll go through some of the functions, guys. I apologise the screen's not overly clear, but there we go. So it's a multilingual data bank there. So mode one, that's your database. You can input... Um, telephone numbers, things like that in there if you want to. <laughs> Not that people you know, are going to use this function anymore. I would have thought most people would use their mobile phones. I know I will be doing uh, and that will take you back to the calculator. So the calculator there, so it literally it's very easy to use. So we go 1, 5, 8, 9, uh, times 8 equals 1272. I'm sure you guys will tell me if that's wrong, but yeah, it's not, it's only a basic calculator. It's useful sometimes if you don't want to pull your phone out your pocket, although I suspect that most of us these days will uh, will carry calculators in, their, in our pockets in the forms of mobile phones. See the home screen there, you've got the, the year, the month and the day. It is the 1st of October today. It is 2 o'clock on a Sunday. Um, you've also got the alarm there and uh, stopwatch and dual time so I don't know where my dual time is set for at the moment 924 I'm sure <laughs> I'm sure uh, someone will, will tell me where that is back to the home screen you can see there the little orange light just goes it is just a, a side illuminator but it's perfectly fine for um, for what you need it for as I say I think this watch does retail around 60 pounds 65 pounds however there's always deals on it, there's always offers, I say, mine was £29.99 uh, from Argos here in the UK, which is, uh, if, for those that don't know, uh, it's kind of like a, a department store or whatever. Um, yeah, really comfortable to wear. I really like this watch, I say, I've been wearing it now for, how long have I had it, around about two weeks. 
and you know, for a cheap Casio, it, it does what it says on the tin, doesn't it? Looks pretty cool, looks pretty retro, I get lots of comments about it. Some good, some bad, but that's that's the way of the world, isn't it, guys? So thanks very much for watching. Uh, if you've got any more questions about this particular watch or about any of the other watches, please feel free to leave a comment, leave a like, leave a dislike. Um, we've got lots more stuff coming up. I'm going to bite the bullet and go for an Apple Watch. So the Apple Watch will be coming soon. That'll be the version 3. We're also going to be looking at uh, a few more Casios, Seikos, more of the Japanese stuff. Swiss high-end stuff's kind of been on the back burner for a while. Um, that's just through my personal circumstances. However, thanks for all your views, guys. We're hitting 26,000 views now. Not sure who you guys are who are watching me, but thanks all the same. Thanks for all the comments, and uh, we'll see you guys soon. Cheers.